Hi there, I hope you're doing well. Uh, in this video today, we're going to be checking out how to put a frame together. This is actually one of the first frames I've put together. Uh, generally, I just tend to hang my drawings up on the wall with a thumbtack. So this is going to be quite a nice change of pace. When I purchased this frame, it originally had some uh, poorly placed hangers. So I decided to remove those and fasten my own. After measuring the inside of the frame, I transferred those numbers to a piece of black presentation board. This piece will be acting as a backer for my drawing and border frame, providing a more professional look if anyone wants to look at the back of it. After I have test fit the backing board, I use that as a template for the outside of the border. Kind of helps save some time, I don't have to remeasure. Uh, but I'm sure to mark the back of the border paper because I don't want to see any markings on the front.
After a bit of measuring and head scratching, I come up with a cutout size that will both frame my artwork nicely, but also have an even reveal around the border of the frame. Once again, all the markings and cuttings I complete from the back side, I'm careful not to overcut the corners, uh, as that can be unsightly from the front. After another test fit, I put some guidelines on the back side of the border paper and tape the drawing into position. Now, with the assembly wrapping up, all I need to do is fix everything together. And to do that, I'm using something called glazier points, which are seated with a hammer and a screwdriver. Uh, hardwood frames may be a bit difficult. Uh, thankfully, mine is fairly soft. After that is complete, all that is left is a find a place on the wall and hang it. 